massive, well, pretty massive for me, clothing haul, and I figured we would do this live and see what you guys think of this, if you guys have heard of this, and yeah, so my memory is full, so get ready. I look so weird from this angle, but I've got a ton of stuff I'm really going to draw up for real this time, and my memory's full, so get ready. Welcome if you're new and come across this for the replay. My name is Kaya, hence the word Kaya Simon's Life. We do a little bit of everything over here. Reactions, tea, news, drama, hauls, dog stuff, lifestyle, and all in between. So welcome. Thank you guys. So what the game plan is, we are going to keep this as always on topic. And we will do our little chit chat with our little soap opera type deal. Chrissy, I hope you feel better. Just breathe and know that it's always going to get better. Um, and we will get, like I said, we're going to get through this, in this, and then we're going to stay on topic. Either of I, Coda. So I'm going to tell you all a little back history about them. And then we will do a live after this with our soap opera type deal situation. So... I hone in on the same hoodies, the same sweats. Welcome, everybody. Um, I kind of just hone in on the same stuff. <laughs> so, I just wanted some casual loungewear that I could finish, you know, into winter. Uh, Y'all, it was, speaking of winter, it was a literal, like, a tornado out there today. I am not exaggerating. Really? I never heard of it, Nashies, until like a month ago. Let me take off my slippers, y'all. Speaking of dills, um, sorry, these are kind of ratty. I will stand on my porch or I'll walk the dogs around the yard. There is, this is the time that things are on sale, winter, going into spring, going into summer. So this is kind of when I get stuff. I'll save it for next year or I'll finish out the season. So I got those slippers I showed y'all at Kohl's. Kohl's is like up to 80% off. Yeah, sick and tired. It, I... I'm not going to lie to you. I was kind of worried, like, please don't let this be episode number two for the pool. Um, I, I was kind of worried for a minute. Um, it, it was pretty wild. So, welcome everybody, and I will tell you, if you do enjoy content like this, this is a non-sponsored video. I would love to be sponsored by this company, but I did purchase these things by myself. So, shoot me a thumbs up, subscribe, and join us if you're already not, if you like holes and stuff like this. So, what white fox is, and then I'll show you what I'm wearing. We'll kind of unbox things, but I'll give you kind of a rundown because I had never heard of it. Um, you guys are going to, I literally, I seen a post, but we'll get into all that, y'all. Let's try to stay on topic, and the quicker we bust through this, then we can get on to our next life. I forgot my drink. I apologize. I am going to grab my drink. Give me two seconds. It's literally right here in the mini fridge. I apologize to you guys, but I'm going to be talking a lot, and I think I'm going to need it. So sorry. So sorry. Sorry about that. I am slipping, y'all. Look at me go. I was trying to do some laundry and some house stuff before I got on here, so I... I'm running a bit late, I'm not going to lie. So, quick uh, quick drink uh, review for the day right quick. I got this earlier, and this is the Panera Cinnamon Toast Crunch Latte. I'm going to say two thumbs down for me. Mine just tasted like milk. So, welcome everybody. So, um, it's good, don't get me wrong, but not impressed. Um... Nothing, nothing Cinnamon Toast Crunch about it. Yeah, y'all, we're going to stay on topic. The quicker we can get through this, the quicker we can get back to our thing. But let's try to stay on topic here. No, it doesn't even taste like that, Kelly. It has nothing to do with Cinnamon Toast Crunch. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I don't know if it's new. I thought, oh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I make a drink at Starbucks that I've concocted up that was on the secret menu. And it blows this to the dust. So, I don't know if I just got somebody made it wrong. Or, um, it's, it's, I'm not getting any cinnamon. No cereal as. So, I'm going to say for the Panera Cinnamon Toast Crunch Ice Latte. 
Y'all haven't been had a good uh, run with drinks lately. I told y'all the avocado pill in the smoothie. Nice bubble tea. All right, y'all. Well, let's go ahead and get into this. And I'll tell you about the company. I'll show you what we're wearing. Grab yourself a drink and a snack because, my, we've got quite the pile here. So, this company is on Afterpay, and that is how your girl gets a lot of things. I really, really love Afterpay. No, Chrissy, I wish I had. I tried to do them years ago when I was younger, and I'm just... Guys, I am not precise. Um, I'm not a crafter. I make stuff for my grandma. She loves it, but... I, I am not precise when it comes to crafting and, you know. Okay, let's do it to it. Let's do it to it. So, White Fox Boutique is a company and it has got a bit of everything. Afterpay Polybug non-sponsored is, yeah, Kelly, I do not have little petite skills like the things you sent me painting the earrings. Thank you, Mason. Um... Afterpay is a, it's it's a layaway, but you get the things now, non-sponsored. Um, there's Nordstrom's, there's Crocs, there's Ulta, there's Sephora, you name it. Um, it's a line of credit. And what it is, it's four, four, four payments, it breaks it down. And I seen this brand, it came across on Afterpay. And I was like, ooh, you know, loungewear. And uh, I'll tell you more. It's more than loungewear. But anyway, so when you build your credit line up, it is a no, it's you're, you're based on trust. So once you get to a certain limit of paying on time, you can switch your payment dates around so often, and then you can get zero down. But you have to get to that point. Uh, there's rewards. You can use it to pay in store after pay. Most stores take after pay. And you get rewards for paying on time, paying early, and so forth. So look it up. Again, non sponsored, but after pay is really good. Um, again, Nords takes it, Nordstrom's. Um, you name it, they take it. And it's, it's basically a layaway, but. Um, I do not know that yet, sick and tired. I do not know if it does build your credit, but I have I have really stayed on time. I've um, built my limit up pretty good, but I still try to stick around. You know, you don't want to go. You got to think at the end of the day, I remind myself, you still have to pay for the stuff. So it's a good way if you see a luxury bag on sale, if you just need a revamp of your closet, but do do remember that um yes, Afterpay is where you can use through any of the sites and it's an app called Afterpay, but um you can get luxury bags, say you know, I find a I'm just going to use Michael Kors for an example. And you say, "Wow, man, this Michael Kors bag is on sale for 150 bucks. It's regularly $300. Um, but I, I don't have $150 right now. But man, I'd really like to have a luxury bag. And this is a great price. So you can buy that bag now. Now when you start it out, you've got to put down... Say the bag is $150. Add tax like any other store. It divides that into four payments. And the first payment is due out of the dividend of four when you first get it. As you build your credit up, it's zero down. Okay, see, Kelly knows about it. So, again, you could you could say, you know, wow, I've always wanted a designer pair of sunglasses or I really want to revamp my... Um, yes, they do increase your credit limit as you pay, but remember, guys, it's like any other thing. You can really get yourself in a pickle... Um, but it's, it's a great program. It's a great way if you, you know, you can buy gift cards for birthdays. You know, it's, it's a really great, great program. So let's move on from that. Just keep in mind, guys, it, it's like a credit card. I mean, it's, it's gotta be paid. Um, it, it has to be paid. Now, the good thing is you can shoot with your PayPal, any of that. And it's very convenient. I really do like it and I enjoy it. Um, but I also have to remind myself sometimes it needs paid. Okay, let's get into it, y'all. Let's get into it. Yes, Shaz. 
So, this is a extra large, large haul. As you guys know, I am plus size. I know a lot of you guys don't believe that, but I truly am. Um... Yes, Kalarn is, a, I use that as well. Some brands only take Afterpay, some take Kalarn, Shopify, all that. So, um, what White Fox is, is White Fox is loungewear. From sweats to sweatpants to accessories to jewelry, earrings. Um, it's all costume jewelry, of course. Um, but there's evening wear, there's bathing suits, there's shoes. You name it. There's jeans. There's tank tops. There's dress clothes. There's club clothes. Any kind of clothes you want is there. Now, this is the first time that I've ordered from this company. I will say that the sweatshirts run true to size. Now, these are the pants. Okay. These are the biker shorts called Project 5 Ribbed Biker Shorts XL. So I notice that um, basically they do different collaborations, different collaborations with people. And this this thing here design with this writing is called colla or, um, Project 5. So these biker shorts are called papaya, the color. And these are an extra large. Now, I will tell you, in my opinion, and of course, I'm going to stand up and show you the whole outfit. The biker shorts do run small. Um, they do. They just do. So, I'm, I'm going to give you a head that the, the sweatshirts are perfectly on task. This is the, and I'm going to stand up, y'all. This is the Project 5 oversized sweatshirt, large, extra large. Um, I do think that the sweatshirts do run. As they say, the biker shorts are a bit snug. I'm not going to lie. So here is what I like about this. So this is the writing. So there's all different writing with their brand. This is the Project 5. So they do little drops, little collaborations, and this one is number 5. And all the writing is like this. Now there's different colors. These are the biker shorts right here. And what I did was, is I tried to find all this color of things that will match. So get ready. Welcome, everybody. You are going to see now. These are the sweatshirts that have the really soft inside. Yeah, these are really soft inside. So if you like that soft fuzzy... Um, it is a bit pricey, but it is quality. I'm not going to lie. Um, I do love the color. There's a tank top I was trying to get a hold of. It's sold out. Um, so here's this. So what I liked was, and you're going to see coming up during our haul, is this is mix and match, but it all goes together. So you've got the blue writing on the biker shorts. And then you've got the orange writing, kind of the peach, on the tank top, okay? So, let's get into the haul. And so, you're probably going to say, Kaya, that's a lot. Well, what I wanted to do is, is I wanted to be able to mix and match. I wanted to be able to throw on these shoes that I got for Christmas. They're not the exact, but they're going to work. And I wanted to be able to pop this on stream with you guys go to the park go to the store i wanted everyday clothes now does this brand have stuff you can rock to the beach and look like a bad bee's on if you got the body absolutely are there twenty thousand renditions of this font of the colors of all this absolutely now this again is not sponsored but i did get 20 percent off for signing up so you can always sign up, get your code, and then if you get 50,000 emails, unsubscribe once you get your gear. I will say this. I have two tank tops I'm debating on taking back. You can only get store credit when you take something back unless it is defective. Okay, so here we go. Let's do it to it. So what I also liked about this was, ooh, excuse me, is... A lot of the sweatshirts came in dust bags. 
And these are great for traveling, purses, storing your hats, uh, socks, unders, anything. So I really appreciate that they come with these dust bags. Um, I really like that. Um, I try to keep my purses all covered up. So I really, there's a couple purses I have that I don't have dust bags. So yeah, shoes while traveling. Um, stock your bathing suits away for next year. And you know they're all, but whatever you want to use them for. I thought that was really nice. And they are nice, the cloth ones, not the fabric that like rips. So they are nice and sturdy. So that'll be good. I got a couple bags that don't have dust bags. So I think that'll be really nice. So there's those. Okay, we are going to do it to it. So let me try and stay in. Okay, so some of them come in zip bags. Some of them don't. Again, I really like to use, reuse these. Um... And do not cut the tags off this stuff unless you know it fits. Do not cut the tags off unless you know. Because a lot of these, you know the company Off-White. A lot of these companies will not take stuff back. Ooh, this looks small. Yikes, I knew it was a crop top. Okay, this is an extra large. This is the Cutting Corners Baby Tee in an extra large. Well, it is good and pulley. So I got this. Sorry, y'all. It's, it's... So I thought that was cute. And I got that to go with... Um, I would say size up other than the sweatpants and the, and the, um, and the sweats, the shorts, the baby tees, um, really do your research. Um, so it does feel good quality. I will say that it's nice and soft, but do not take these off. Um, Unless you know that it's going to fit. Because a lot of these companies, once you cut those, it's... Um... So, in the future, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to keep this. But in the future, I probably won't get any more of these baby... Uh, that would be really cute and gauge. Got them. Um, I probably won't... Um... Now, you could always pull, put a tank top underneath this. But I probably won't buy any more of these baby tees. Um, so there's that. Now what I got this to go, I tried to make like outfits. Um, a lot of stuff was sold out when I got it. They've revamped some or restocked. But um, a, a lot of it was sold out. So I kind of made my own. So here's the sweats. Or no, this is the hoodie. Okay, so this is the hoodie that I got to go with that. These are really soft, really good quality. Um, they kind of remind me, the best I can say, welcome Dixie. The best I can say these remind me of, y'all watch for the silica, uh, the silica packets. The best I can say that these remind me of is American Eagle, I would probably say. Welcome, everybody. No, this is from Australia. It is a popular Australian brand. And they started from the ground up a small business. So that is what I got to go with the baby tee. Um, unfortunately, the sweatpants were sold out, but I think I picked up a pair of black. Don't quote me. So, this is really soft, you guys. I really think this is good quality. And again, and look. So, it's basically the print. It says, always fresh. Um, and here, it's basically the same. I don't know, Peachy. I honestly am not going to lie to you. This is, I'm pretty new to this brand. Um, I was just looking for some loungewear. Now, like I said, guys, why I fold this up, there is, if you're going to vacation, if you're going to a resort, 
there's bad B Zonda. Um, there's there's bathing suits, there's sexy Instagram, bad B Zonda dresses, diva dresses, but um not really for me. So if you're tiny or you're looking, and there were some long, nice ones. Um, I did pick up one summer item for swimming, and I'll show you guys. So here's the pants. Again, love a dust bag. You can't go wrong, y'all, with these. And um, this is the pants that I picked up because the cherry ones were sold out. So I really tried to stay welcome, everybody. I tried to make outfits, but like I said, a lot of it was sold out. So I kind of just thought, okay, it's got white in. They're black sweatpants. They, it's going to work. Be careful if you've got pets, silica packets. You know what? I'm going to start this bag as a silica packet. So it's just got literally, okay, so these are, these are an extra large and they're just a nice black sweatpants and they just got the white Fox athletics. They do have pockets. I do love that. And they're just a basic, nice sweatpants. So I could rock this with anything I got, but I got this to go with the cherry set. Now the black is kind of off. If you can see here. Um, you know, but I, I, I don't care. I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm hanging out with y'all running to the store. You know, I could wear this to the movies or whatever, you know, it's, it's lounge wear. So I kind of, that's what I had to find. You know, it was really hard finding, um, a lot of this was sold out, y'all. I'm not going to lie. And I really tried to stay somewhat on a budget. I know it's not going to look like it, but... I really did try to stay on one. Okay, so here is these. Now, this is the sweatpants to go with this hoodie. Welcome, everybody. So, what the method to my mad was, madness is, is right puppies, rubies, and that's exactly. Sorry, I'm trying to get these silica packets to the wobbles. Not that they come in here, but... Um, So these are the sweatpants that match this writing. And like I said, there's so many different writing, you know, if you're not into this font. Um, like I said, a lot of it was sold out, so I kind of just had to go with... Okay, so these go with this. So these go with that. So there's an outfit. But I kind of switched it and swapped it around to where I could wear this, and you'll see I kind of switched it around. So, these are an extra large. I think that's a great true to size. They've got elastic, very heavy, very thick, soft inside. And again, this is the Project 5, oh, these are a 2X. My bad. Project 5 Sweatpants 2X Color Grape. Um, it's a brand called White Fox Boutique out of Australia. So there's those. So the legs are just a regular sweatpants leg. And what the method to my madness, you're going to see I have other pieces coming up, is I could switch this all around. Is what the method to my madness was. I, I wanted to be able to say, okay, if this is dirty, then I can, okay. This is what I wanted from this site. And if I take back, I think I'm going to return to tank tops. I'm going to show you all. But there's a pair of leggings that go with this peach writing set. And that is what caught my eye on seeing this website. Look at this color, y'all. It is so pretty. And this is what caught. So the girl in the picture had on these really pretty um, she had on these really pretty peach, like, shorts. Y'all, there's so many, there's all kinds of shorts, as you're going to see coming up. There's biker shorts, there's sweatpants shorts, there's, there's all kinds. There's ribbed ones, and like I said, there is dress clothes, but I'm going to be honest with you guys, 
I'm pretty good on dress clothes. I don't go since the pan, the demic. Sorry, I'm getting hot trying to rush through this. Um, I do have good outfits if I want to go to a nice dinner, but this was the basis of loungewear. If, if I can pop this on, go run around with Grandma, something that I can get home, stream with y'all. I'm still warm. It still looks cute, and I can switch all this around. So this one is an extra large, large that I had on, or excuse me, a large, extra large. And this was the Project 5 Oversized Sweatshirt Large, Extra Large. And this is just the non-hoodie sweatshirt. So each of these writings has, like there's Project 1, 2, 3, 4, there's always, but they all have like a different theme to them. So there's a set, but I'm going to show y'all. So this is what caught my eye. This is the Offstage Hoodie Large Extra Large Azure. A-Z-U-R-E. So this is really cute. So this girl had this one in the picture. Welcome, everybody. And she had some really cute, but the pants, the little shorts were sold out. If y'all go on the site, this girl had these shorts on with this color. And it had this blue writing, and they was sold out. And it looks so cute. So it's just got the white fox on the back, number three. Yeah, there was a really, like I said, I wish I could maybe by the time if I take back these two uh, tank tops that I can maybe get a hold of these shorts. Okay, here's the tank tops. Well, let's do those last because I want to not wreck those. I'm probably going to send them back. Okay, let's keep going to get through and then we'll get down to some of the summer stuff. Okay. So these is to go with the set. So these are the Project 5 Lounge Shorts 2X. Um, I probably could have got an extra large in these. Again, I would rather things be bigger than smaller. Um, you can always fold them down. You know, the old school folding down the sweatpants. I really like this stuff. I really do. And this is stuff that I'll wear. It's not going to lay around. It's I, I wanted stuff that I could get everyday use out of. I, I didn't need any dress clothes. I just needed some everyday. So here we go. So say we're coming into spring or I'm hanging out with y'all and y'all know I'm always hot. I can mix and match this. If I want to wear the hoodie with the shorts, if I decide, you know, whatever, this is the shorts that go with it. So these are the Project 5 Lounge Shorts 2X. So again, really thick. And yeah, so they've got a drawstring, of course. And like I said, I really, my, my theory was to mix and match all this up, was what I was going for. And again, if you're not into this font, like I said, I mean, y'all, I... I was scrolling on the site, and I was like, let me stop. Um, I I was, there's so many different, but see how those go together. And then I picked up the hoodie that goes with the set. So I have all this that goes, now there's other pieces with it. Did I not get, I swear I thought I got, well, maybe I put them, I swear I got a different, there's another pair of shorts that goes with this set. Well, maybe they didn't have my size or I took them out of my cart. And this is the hoodie that goes with it. So I've got four pieces here. And again, if you don't like it, there's, there's other shorts and stuff that match this um, as well. So I've got the biker shorts here on. I wish I would have got the other shorts now that I have the biker shorts, but that's okay. Sorry, y'all. This, you know, this room is small, so I'm trying to... Okay, so this is the hoodie that goes with it. And like I said, each font has a different design, and the backs are all different. So if this isn't your jam... So this one kind of has like a swirly circle and like the, the writing's kind of melting. So that's the Project 5. 
Y'all know, hold on, I can't stand random strings and fuzz. So this is the Project 5 Oversize Hoodie, Large, Extra Large, and Grape. Welcome everybody. Thumbs up, subscribe, and join us. Welcome if you're new. Welcome for being here, everyone. So that's the set. So maybe when I take back these tank tops. Sorry, y'all. I was making sure I'm like, is that? Oh, it's just strings. Okay. So there's that. Okay, moving on to... Um, the price points are, it's it's a little pricey, but you get 20%. They have clearance. I've checked out. It does seem like the bigger sizes go quick. Um, there are some really good clearance deals. I was looking for when I take these two tank tops back. Um, but uh, like I said, I got 20% off and then you got the afterpay, of course. Okay. Okay, so, bathing suits. I'm very particular, even though I swim at my house the majority of the time. I like to have stuff. If I go boating, if I would go to a beach, vacation, whatever, I'm getting older. I don't want my asparagus hanging out. Now, I will say this site has a lot of super cute bathing suits, but I'm getting older. I don't want every, my bits and bobs hanging out. I, I, so... I did pick, um, I did pick out, um, these are called White Fox Swim. It says designed in an Australia. These are the Sandy Skies Booty Shorts Tropical Horizon and an extra large. So I thought these would be really cute, um, Unfortunately, all the tops that I found were not going to do your girl justice. So I figured, I think I've got a pink, like a light. Um, Y'all remember that lavender American Eagle top I got? I've got it. I can always pick up, go through the tops I got. And here's those. And they're just a swim material. Um, these are an extra large. These look like a large to me. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, there were so many things to this. There was mesh tops, there was mesh skirts, there was tops, there was bottoms. But, again, I'm a little top heavy if you catch my drift, so you, you're not going to see your girl in a string bikini. So, um, there was one that came across, straight across, and had straps, but it had, like, underneath uh, boobage. And, again, most of the time, if I'm hanging out with y'all, I can't have that, and I don't want my neighbors to see the toddles. And if I'm on a boat, you know, I'm at that age where it wouldn't be bad, but with the size of my top, it looked like it would be too much under boobage. So I do wish they would have had like a tankini or something to go with this, but it's all good. I do think I've got kind of like this lavender pink that I can rock with this, or y'all know I'll pull together something. So there was all kinds of pieces with this. I just, um... You know, I, I was like, mm, mm But really cute. If you've got the body, you know, it, it, it was a really cute set. But I do think, remember that American Eagle Light Lavender Top, y'all, I have? It looks kind of like a sports bra tankini. I think it'll go with that. Now, I do have a bathing suit coming up and a sarong. I had an American Eagle reward, and I got a bad bizonda bathing suit it's another one piece and it is awesome so i'll show you all that this week okay this is what i got to wear over this i thought if i'm boating or like you know some places docks have like bars at the beach um i got this to go this kind of remind me that it would go together so i thought that was super cute so this is an extra large. This is called Stay Wild Tank Top in White Extra Large. So I thought that would match the little booty shorts. And it's kind of like a crop top, but it covers, you know, my stomach. It's kind of like the muscle tee. Um, I really am not a big fan of white, but um, I thought this really went with this. 
not 100%, but you know when I'm hanging out, I don't care. So that was the method to the madness with that. And again, I could wear this with some nice jean shorts or whatever. And, uh, you know, I thought that was super cute. Gives really summer vibes, beach vibes. Throw some little earrings on or jean shorts with my Crocs. And, you know, if I'm going somewhere, put these, you know... I could put this over a bathing suit with, with my bottoms here. Oh, okay. I was like, is it, it's got some little little rips on the side. It's meant to be like that, so that's cute. Yeah, Polybug. I just thought this was really kind of like a... What do y'all think? Like a 2000s, 90s pack sun vibe is what that gave me. Okay, y'all. Moving right along. So here's where things are going to get interesting. This is where things are... Sorry, I try to keep things that way when I put it away. It's organized and I know which drawer it goes in. And If Batris would come in here and say hi to Owen, and draw water. Okay, this is where things get interesting. Well, let's do this one and then I'll show you all the ones I think I'm going to take back. So, these are the tank tops. Now, this is where life gets interesting. Um, these are all over the place. I did not drop the link. Um, I cannot drop a link right now since I'm on my phone. Oh, excuse me. Um, it's called White Fox Boutique. And non-sponsored, y'all. Because I do have some things coming up, so I don't want to confuse. Okay. Um... Yikes. I didn't know this was a crop top. Well, puppy zoobies, I love them. Yikes. I don't, man, I should have never filed that return first. I might have to. Let's just try this on right quick. Yikes. This is, hold on and I'll tell y'all what it is. I don't know about this. This is where it gets weird, the tank tops. Sports Series Tank Extra Large Charcoal. Okay, I might... Actually, I better not try this on. I have fresh deodorant. Um, I think I'm going to have to send this back, my friends. I don't think it's going to work. Even though I lose a little bit of weight in the summer, it's... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to send this back. Well, there's the logo. Isn't it like a 90s, 2000... Yeah, I think I... God, dog on it. Yeah, even you guys, I lose weight in the summer. I don't think... Maybe I'll try it on tomorrow when I get at the shower without my deodorant, but I don't want to... Um, it's very good quality. But uh, I just don't think maybe for me... Um, now, this is where it gets weird. All the sweats, all the hoodies seem to be on point. The tank tops are what, yeah, I would only, like, I wouldn't wear this out, like, I would wear this, like, in the yard, like, hanging out with y'all, throw it over my bathing, like, I'm not wearing this to the store or some shit. Like, this is, like, chilling gear. Welcome, our lady. Like, this would be something if we're hanging out out back and it's super hot, like, but I'm not gonna wear this to, like, y'all know what I mean, a dog show or... Um, but I do think this is going to go back. So just keep in mind that's an extra large, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, let me put this back. I think I'm going to take that back. It's just not... Um, even if I would wash it in cold and hang it to dry, it's just not... What? Okay, sorry, y'all. It's just not... Um, nah... Okay, let's put this back, y'all. Sorry. So the tank tops is, again, the only thing that really threw me off. Um, yeah, sorry, y'all. I don't want it to get any dog hair or anything on it, and we'll get that. Actually, let me move all this away from the coffee. It looks dangerous. Okay, that can go back. Here is another tank top. The tank tops are what threw me off. Now, this one I might keep, um, this one I might keep, but the next two coming up are what are going back, I think. So, basically, I'm doing, like, a revamp of my wardrobe. 
I have been taking stuff to the consignment store and I'm really going through things and saying, you know, if I've had it for years, sell it if it's in good shape. If not, donate it. But that is what I'm doing. Okay. Wow. So this is Move On Up Tank Top Extra Large. Um, it's a very good quality tank top. Like, it's really like, see, it's kind of like, it's not just a cotton. Yeah, this is going to have to go back to. <laughs> I'm like, okay, so note to self, you guys and me, the tank tops are made small from what we see. Um, this is not an extra large. Yeah, it's very nice. I mean, the fabric is thick, y'all. Um, this is just like a Target. You know, a just a rib tank top. Um, it's very sturdy, you guys. It's very thick. It is quality if you're smaller. But, guys, this is not an extra large. Let's be real here. That That is not an extra large. But, I mean, it's a very thick quality. I mean, it's very soft. It's very thick. Sorry, I know I keep... Yeah, it is, Nashies. It's got that breathable mesh. But it's great quality. But, guys, get... This is not an extra large. White Fox, if you see this, come on, man. Look at that, y'all. Even if it's a crop top. Guys, that's a medium or a small, dude. Look at that. Like, there's no way I gotta be careful with my deodorant, but... Look at that. I mean, it does have pull to it. I could probably make this work, but... Exactly, Our Lady. But I'm not going to look like a sausage festival. They don't, I don't think they have all the way up that much Nashies or I would have ordered up. Yeah, I don't think they had the tank tops. I think the extra large. Yeah, so that's got to go back. Okay, well, I might have a little more budget. I swear I thought I got another pair of shorts that were like miscolored. So, okay, well, that's, yeah, that's not getting me nowhere, guys. It, even if I wash that, okay, let's get that in the bag. I apologize, y'all. Um, I'm trying to just so they don't get dog hair, you know, which I don't want to send stuff back with dog hair. You know how particular companies are. Plus, I don't want, you know, this to get hairy and somebody else, um, you know, it, it get dog hair or something. Okay, well, that goes back. So that was the Move On Up Tank Top Extra Large. White Fox, my friend, your tank top sizes are off. That is my only complaint thus far. Y'all, that was like a large or a, a medium small. Okay, well, that goes back. So these are the next two things that I'm pretty sure I think I already filed a return on these. Okay, my friends. So, in the picture, and this is probably my fault, guys. Research what the fabric says. Um, these, I don't know. Now, actually, see, now that I look at these, these have more hope than those do. Um, I thought these were, welcome everybody. I thought these were just a tank top in this fabric. Now, this is my fault. I should have. So, this is like a polyester silky. It's very nice. This is more like a dress tank top. This is more like throw on some nice jewelry. You got a nice bag. And this is more like a dress. So, I might... Man, I'm worried about my deodorant, y'all. <laughs> Let's try this one carefully. Um, you know what? I'm not going to do it. I'm going to get deodorant on it. Okay, y'all. I think just by me trying to put my arms in this... Yeah, I'm going to look like a sausage festival. That's why I got it, DG, the neckline. I thought just a couple nice chains. You could dress this up with a nice bag, a nice belt. But so um, so I got the next one in black, y'all. This is called the Fell in Love Top. Fell in Love Top Extra Large. And this is charcoal. Now, these did come in many different colors. And I thought that was a really cool neckline. But, um, no. Me too, Razor Cat. Yeah, I can't. I'm going to look like a sausage festival. And we don't want that. So, that goes back. And then I'll show you all the black one. And I think that is it. Oh, I got one more thing from Kohl's I'll show you all. 
that I used my Kohl's cash when I told y'all I had. Wait till you see this thing I got from Kohl's. It's pretty cool and it was expensive as all get up. And uh, I got it for a really good price. And some of y'all might be able to find it at your Kohl's and it's actually useful. Okay, well. So note to self, everything looks good. Yeah, Razor Cat. Everything as far as the loungewear seems to be on point but the tank tops. So read the reviews, you guys. Um, I, I kind of had all this in my cart and I thought, you know, I always wear tank tops every day. Be nice to have a couple nice fancier tank tops, you know. But um, so so it's looking like, guys, that the uh, narrative is is the tops are smaller. Okay. Michelle says, welcome, love. I'm in Australia, and the tops are tiny for Aussie sizing. Okay, but our loungewear is massive. Okay. Um, sounds like it's a me thing. Okay, thank you for telling me. Well, it's a learning lesson, and like I said, I'll have store credit, so I'm not tripping. The return, here's one thing so far that I did learn about this company. No BS. You go in there, it's like dolls kill. You check what you're going to get rid of doesn't fit too big too small always leave comments you guys because it will help them you know if if you know hey i'm in the u.s i'm in canada i'm in such and such um you know you can say you know i'm in the u.s you know this isn't a large for us that will help them you know so always be honest um or if you just simply don't like it so, I, I'll have store credit, so I'm not tripping. And like I said, it was really easy. I punched in my order number. I punched in my email. Okay, so maybe it was a me thing. Then I apologize. Australia sizes, I think, are similar to UK sizes. Okay, thank you guys. So, maybe it was a me thing. I'm not familiar with this. I'm not going to lie, so... Thank you, guys. Thank you, Jade, as well. Um, I apologize, guys. Again, I'm not familiar with this. So, it was a me thing. Sorry about that. So, this guy is the Fell in Love Top Extra Large in Black. And this is just, I thought I'd have a nice staple thing. A nice staple piece that you could throw on a nice jewelry, wear a nice bag, and go to, like, a nice dinner. You know, a, a casual... Um, you know, not a super fancy restaurant, but y'all catch my drift, like a little bistro, set out on the patio, have a drink, you know, so it's a great tank top. Don't get me wrong. I mean, it's not, this doesn't feel like Shein to me and nothing against Shein. I want to say that, but this is, you can tell it is, it is Michelle, Michelle. It really is. Um, you can feel this is quality. I mean, look at that. Um, it, it doesn't feel like cheapy, fa um, fast fashion. It, it, it really doesn't. So it's got a really cool square neckline. So I apologize. Like I said, um, you know, it, it's a me thing. I didn't know, you know, the sizes, but, um, I am really happy with everything else that I got. Yeah. It's, it's like I said, it's definitely not Shein. Yeah. And here, uh, here you are. I'm impressed. And like I said, I didn't get ripped off. I'll use my store credit. And, and now that I know, you know, what's what, you know, to be careful with the tank tops and stuff, um, you know, then, then I'll know how to order, you know, with my credit. So, um, I'm impressed. Like I said, I, I'm not salty. The, the, it was very easy, um, it was very easy to file the return. Like I said, I simply put my order number in. I simply put my um, my order number in and my email. And I just checked and it'll say, you know, it'll show the pictures. You check the box and say why. It had an option things and then you could leave a comment. So, um, pretty easy. And another thing I want to tell you guys is I was very impressed with is... Um, Yes, I do puppy zoobies, but it was very easy. I printed off a label and bingo, bango. I, you guys, I have till the 26th, which I'm going to take it back tomorrow, obviously. Quicker you get things in, the quicker, you know, I can get pieces and get it back. You know, um, you guys, they gave me till the 26th to return this. 
I thought that was very fair. I had no problems printing off a label at all. Um, you could drop it to any carrier. Good night, Gail. Um, a lot of things that I've messed with, it's always a, a nuisance. Um, they want you just to drop it. I don't have a FedEx in my town. I have FedEx drop-off spots, but nowhere that prints labels. So I deal with UPS or the post office. Now, no disrespect to anybody's post office, but I lost a big, big package when the vid started. I sent to my family with cleaning products, and it was over a lot of money. And they put the postcard on my family's door, and they never got it. Yeah, that's what I was really impressed, sick and tired. Um, they asked, which I keep the bags anyways, to re reduce and reuse cycle. Um, so I kept the bag, thank goodness, which I always do. It's an easy way to keep trash down and recycle. So they said, put it back in the bag if you have it. If not, try to put it, you know, in something where, so I got the bag still. I'm going to tape it up, put the stuff in. I've already printed my label and I'm going to drop it off at UPS and then I should have my store credit. So I'll show you guys if you would like to see what I get back. Um, let me show you guys an item that I got from Kohl's. Oh, no. Always keep that slip. Another thing I've been seeing is sometimes you get a $5 Kohl's cash when you return stuff at Amazon. My grandma goes through these phases. Welcome back, living. Kohl's is a department store here for us, uh, Michelle. It's, um... Guys, I don't know much about Australia, but what would you consider it for me, Shell? Um, if any of you guys know about Australia. Um, it's clothes, blankets, candles. Um, if you get bored, look it up. It's K-O-L-H-S. Um, it's just a department store with a little bit of everything. Okay, y'all. Let me show you what I got. And, um, yeah, it's just like a department store. There's no food or nothing. Well, there's, like, boxes of chocolates and stuff for Easter and Valentine's Day. Um, I want to show you guys what I got. Nah, it's not like a Target. Um, it does have Sephora now. But it's kind of more like, yeah, like a Kmart. Um, so check this out. I had a Kohl's cash, and I have been buying these storage boxes, y'all. The, the pack parties. And these finally went on sale, y'all. The pack party boxes. So, I'm redoing this card over here for our new light. And I had been getting the packed party and I thought, you know what? I'm pretty good on the pack party until I do this cart. I should have enough. And I've been doing these drawers. <coughs> so, these are packed party as well. These little acrylic trays. So, I've been redoing all my stuff. Really trying to get organized, you guys. Really trying to, you know, if I don't need it, it needs to go. Somebody else can use it. I can use the. What I do is I can sign my stuff and then I pay for my new stuff. That's what I do. I kind of do like a recycle type deal. I'll, I'll take a bunch of stuff to the consignment. When I get my consignment money, I'll put it on my afterpay. That, that's kind of like what I do. Welcome, gal. So anyways, these pack parties have been... Yes, Kohl's is like a Walmart on steroids. And I love Meyer too. So anyway, so these are on sale now, y'all. There's all different ones. They're called packed party. So I've been in the packed party and I thought, eh, I think I'm pretty good. I don't know how many more I need, but... I, I just better wait till I finish in here and in case I don't need them. This is pack party as well. This backpack when I went on vacation. This is packed party. Packed party is like a glittery type-esque type organization. There's a little bit of everything, but it's like glitter-esque. It's my vibe. Welcome, damn Kate. Okay, y'all. So... I got this Kohl's cash, like I said, anyways, make sure you're part of Kohl's Rewards, and now you can combine it with your Sephora. You can combine, you cannot use your Kohl's cash in Sephora, but Sephora will help you earn Kohl's Rewards. 
So know that you can connect them together. Oh, you're good, Sarah. Okay, so I had been looking at this. I've been looking at this. Yes, glitter is just sick and tired. I'm still a big old kid. Y'all know that. Okay, so I will tell you how much I paid for this. Sorry, y'all. Okay, this, this is a... It's by the brand Cool Tree or Cola Tree. Eco-minded goods. Now, there's some really other cool ones I'm going to keep my mind on that are more like fuzzy and fleece. So, this is the K-H-C-H-U-L-A Adventure Blanket. Welcome, everyone. So, this blanket says... Camping, hiking, beaches, cabins, boating, picnics, hunting, festivals, cookouts, and more. Spill-resistant, converts into an emergency poncho, connectable snaps to join multiple blankets, antimicrobial, stuffs into a pillow, zippered storage pockets. Watch Coolatree.com for the full video of features. Spot clean is needed. For out thorough cleaning, use a mild detergent and a front-loading hang to dry. The seasoned blanket can be retreated with DWR coating to maintain water repellent. Y'all, I'm going to tell you how much this blanket was. So here's the design. So what I thought was, this would be great for a picnic, boating, anything anything and if i'm back there hanging out with y'all i love to okay good looking out now she says they sell the coating on amazon right here you are like can can it can it swim for me and bronze me up so it's really nice though it kind of gives like that campy type you know i'm a recycling vegan i i love the earth you know it kind of gives that vibe so it's very sturdy and guess how much this blanket was. And I'm going to tell you how much do you think I got it for. Okay. This blanket was $87. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it does have a zip pocket. Look, y'all. I, I wish, Kelly. I'm not that slick. Yes, five. Yes, exactly, our lady. We're going to be eating granola Shaking tambourines, playing the bongo drums. Okay, this was $87. How much do you think I got the blanket for? I got the blanket for... It was $40, $43 with another 50% off that, and I had a $20 Kohl's cash. So it was half of the 43 and I got it for basically next to nothing. I was like that is a no brainer the packed pant the packed party stuff can wait. So I think this is going to be really awesome. It's going to be just I can put it on my lounger out there. We can take it in tiny if I go camping, vacation. It literally stuffs into a pillow. It's got a zipper pocket if I want to put it on my chair outside. Now, they're still got those lanterns, y'all, that I showed you guys. There's some blankets that are from another brand that are really neat. And they kind of give like an, um, like an Aztec. And they're more like a fleecy. And I've been had my eye on those. So I thought this was a great deal. I thought this is really going to be cool in the summer. And it's got a bunch of stuff in the middle here, but um, it's a blanket, Erin, that turns into a poncho that, that, that you know, keeps up on Chantal. It writes letters. Um, but no, I'm joking. So it says it is, what did it say, yo? Oh. Sustainable protection, tree-friendly packaging, recycled materials, green facilities... And it says, water resistant, spill resistant, converts into an emergency poncho, connects with snap to mo join multiple blankets, antimicrobial, 
antimicrobial, stuffs into a pillow, zippered pocket, and then I guess watch a video and it does more. I can't talk, y'all. So, I'm pretty impressed. Um, I, I thought this is going to be, I think what I'm going to really use this for is, um, I'm going to use this like as a outside blanket. Put it on my little, y'all know that chair I sit in my long chair outside? I think this will be really nice for that if I want to take it in tiny. Um, yes, you can use it. Oh, let me stop. <laughs> I was going to see it. Anyway, so it's Cola Tree Eco-Minded Goods. So I was like, that was a good, this was a good find, y'all. It really was. You can tell, y'all, it's, it's, it looks, you know, it's not the thickest blanket. I'm going to be honest with you. But it's sturdy, and you can tell that it is a quality-made blanket. And no, I would never pay $87 for a blanket of this stature. I've done some dumb shit in my life, but, um, you know, this would be like... What I thought was cool about this is the dogs. It looks like you could shake off water or shake off their hair. Say I went on a picnic, took them to like a creek or a lake or something. That's kind of the vibe I gathered with this. You know, because my unhealthy relationship with the Wubbles. So, yeah. So, there's that. So, y'all keep your eyes peeled. And there's that. And like I said, it was another 50% off that. All right, y'all. Well, I think that is that. Uh, we do have other stuff coming up that I've been shaking down along the way. We still got our skincare. I got like two, three more swipes of what I'm using. And then we're going to finish. Um, I'm going to show y'all what I was done with my skincare and then um really tracy see y'all we don't have sam's or costco where i'm at y'all always say that we have it in the big city but we don't have it so y'all kohl's is up to 80 percent off some days they have another 30 you can combine kohl's cash or um well your kohl's cash too but you can combine the coupons too with the clearance right now just make sure some brands oh sarcastic i hope you feel better it's out there i hear a lot of people um weren't feeling the greatest so use your kohl's cash make sure you combine if you buy from sephora connect that with um connect that with your um Sephora rewards if you use Sephora. Um, be careful. Some coupons. Now, the pack party won't take coupons. You can use your Kohl's cash, but it will not take coupons, but it is on sale. You can get it with your rewards, but it won't take more coupons. I tried to get one, okay, online, because I tried to get in the store, and they were not having it. I wanted some crab legs. We did a seafood boil in the summer. And I was already up in the city, and they was like, no, ma'am. <laughs> and the ironic thing was, y'all, this lady literally came out carrying a big thing of crab legs. And I was like, meh. I was like, really? I almost wanted to say, can I buy them off of you? But I didn't. Wouldn't be, you know. All right. Well, let me throw away this trash. Yeah, now nah, she's that is handy. Well, that's good to know. I wish I would have known that the day of the crab leg debacle. Oh, good. Channing Walker, welcome. Channing says, spending, spending, spending. Well, Channing, you got to have some clothes, buddy. All right, y'all. Well, I say we wrap this up. I'm going to put all this away, and I'm going to put these in a bag, the ones I'm sending back, so, you know, they stay nice and fresh. And um, we will talk about what is brewing or what is not or what is. Um, so I did notice something. Um, I did notice something, but we'll get into that in the next video. Right before I started, I noticed something. So don't spoil it if you know what I'm talking about. So thank you guys so much for being here. Method of the Madness. We learned that this is pretty good stuff. I like it. Tank tops are not for the big or busted. And thank you guys for teaching me about Australian sizes. I do appreciate that. So just be careful with the shorts. Let me be careful so I don't. Um, just be careful with the shorts. Um, they are run a bit small. And just be careful with the tank tops. Yes, we are going to talk about that. So 
Other than that, I think the loungewear is true to size. I do like white folks. If you ever see this, I doubt you will, but I do like... Some of us are bigger out here, White Fox. Please, please offer to X. Please. No, it's not a duffet. It's where you can connect them, Fran. It says you can connect them, and then it's got a zipper pocket. Yeah, I cannot stand duvets, yo. I grew up with a duvet as a kid. You will not catch me buying a duvet in my life. My mom be like, take your duvet off and get your comforter out. And I'm like... Then you had to button each button, and it was like this fancy, I know, I will not buy a duvet cover. Yes, Nashies, this is one thing y'all will never see on this channel is a duvet cover. Especially now that I got the wobbles. Yeah, what duvets are, I know most of you guys know. Yeah, we're coming right back, Amber. Okay, y'all, let me clean up this mess. You know I hate random strings, so let me throw those puppers away. Um, I like the white fox. Yeah, Angela, my mom would be like, come on, time to wash your, you know, time to wash your blanket. So what a duvet, I think most of you guys know is it's the cover and then a comforter goes in it and it's all, there's really nothing to hold it in place, at least the one that I had. It was fancy. Uh, Nikki T, I don't know what the second is. Yeah, it's a workout and it's right locale. It's, it just, the duvet that I had was fancy, and it had like, I don't even, it was like lacy quilted type deal, um, and it had buttons, but nothing really kept the, the comforter in, you know, to move around the duvet. Oh, it's not a quilt. It, it's, it, it's like a hot pocket for a comforter. It's like a blanket that tucks in a blanket like an envelope. It's like a it's like a hot pocket for a comforter. Yeah, see, this was back when I was growing up, Ginger. So, you know. All right, y'all. Let's do it to it. Let's can this. And thank you guys so much for being here and being interested in other stuffs. What the hell did I just say? Thank you for being interested in other stuffs. <laughs> ah. Let me get my coffee in me and put this away. Yes. It's like it's like a blanket cover type deal. Um, all right, y'all. I just really said thanks for liking other stuffs. All right. Thank you, honestly, for being here. I really do like white. Uh, there you go, Iron. It's like a pillowcase for a comforter. Thank you. So, I'm going to put this up my desk. Put this up my desk. Yo, where am I at here? Can I get can I pull it together before the next video? Get this off my desk. Thank you so much for being here and interested in other stuff. And I like these clothes. Again, go back if you're coming in. I really watch for the tank tops and some of the biker shorts. Do size up if you would yeah. Put it up my desk. Yeah, can I uh, get my coffee in me? I'm like... <laughs> so, just do you guys' research. Again, I didn't know about the Australian sizes. So, do your research, re-reviews. Um, but as far as the loungewear, I would say it's a thumbs up. My bad on the tank tops. I probably should have did more research and reviews and stuff like that. So... If you're big or busted, I do not suggest the tank tops. Again, watch two of their crop tops. But if you guys are looking for, like I said, I mean, there's costume jewelry, shoes, bags, bathing suits, fancy outfits. If you want to, you know, go to the club or you're going to a resort or something, there's a little bit of everything. I'm not going to lie to you. I, I couldn't even get through the whole site. I was like, stop. So, I am going to send this stuff back tomorrow, and it'll be cool. I'll show y'all what I get if you guys would like to see. So, thank you so much for joining me for other stuffs. And my name is Kaya, as most you guys know, but for the replay. My name is Kaya. We have a good time over here, and we do a little bit of everything. Hence the word Kaya Simon's life. Tea, news, reacts, drama, hauls, bloopers, lots of coffee, and everything in between. I'll see y'all in about 10 to 15. If not, have a great day, great night, and Kaya's out. See y'all in about 10, 15, guys. Bye. Yes, I really am coming back. I promise. I'm...
shoving this up my desk and cleaning up this. I got, I had a Victoria's Secret bag to put the um, silica package. So, 10 to 15, literally, I'm not BSing. I, I really, I'm ready to do this. So, I love y'all. I'll see you back in a minute. Bye, guys. Thanks for being here.